Okay, so I have a small Walmart haul and then today I have to go to No Frills and get the rest of my groceries for this week. We're a little bit behind. Um, by the time we got home last night, uh, I just did not get a chance to film it. So some of the stuff is already missing, gone, opened, eaten, <laughs> but I wanted to show anyways, even though that's just life, that's the way it goes. So, um, over here we needed dog food. I only got a small bag because next week is my bigger stock. Next week is my bigger like end of the week stock up or end of the month, sorry, stock up. So I will get another bag or maybe just, we'll see. Normally I get everything towards the end of the month. Sometimes I buy my dog food on Amazon. Um, anyways, we got wipes. I grabbed the wrong ones, but they'll do. I just have to find, I just have to find something to put them in because I grabbed the ones in the wrong bag. Needed flour. Maze flour was on sale. I almost should have got two. It just wasn't in my budget for this week. Well, um, toilet paper, again, on sale. I should have got two because it was like half price. Best deal ever. Um, and then I raided the discount section at Walmart because they always have some good stuff in there. Not always. Sometimes. So we've got snap peas. We're already down and almost finished an entire bag. And then um, the broccoli and carrots we'll have for dinner tonight. We're having meatballs. Um, I believe we're having honey garlic meatballs, but we got two different kinds of sauce to try. This one is pineapple, and then we got honey garlic. And we'll have meatballs and rice. That's Mikey's pick. Um, some bananas. They didn't really have much for fruit at Walmart, so I'll get that at No Frills. And then BJ wanted these that he said he would share with Isla. He just, I let him pick it. We were in the stock. And then I got this for Isla to try. I normally make my oatmeal, um, but this has some added nutrition and stuff. So I'm going to give that one a try and see how she likes it. Oops. Oh, I just got on. Oh, don't do that. There's a hole in the side of it. Don't push on it because you guys have already been climbing all over it. All right. Where was I? Um, jar pickles, soy sauce, because I ran out last week, and then some barbecue sauce for the chicken legs we're going to have. I have to get those at the other grocery Yay. store. Um, and then they were restocked on these noodles. The kids absolutely love these noodles. When I was pregnant with BJ, I ate at least one pack of these a day. They were like one of my favorite cravings. They're so good. Um, somewhat of a, not an acquired taste, like they're a little bit on the like oniony side, I guess you could say, but they're, they're good. Uh, some noodles for the week, marshmallows so we can make treats and brown sugar. Oh, helicopter. Um, pretzel twists, croissants. They're all gone. I also bought some danishes. They're all gone already. Uh, granola bars and crackers. Cause the best spot is usually Walmart for crackers. And we got a hummingbird feeder. And I think that concludes, that's right, picked by you and dad. I think that concludes Walmart. I don't know. I feel like there's probably, oh, and I had a whole chicken, but we had that for dinner last night. So yeah, I think that's it from Walmart. And then we also had another trip to the dollar store. Um, this one was just a small trip because I needed some things for Isla. Um, I got this new container. This is a really nice, it's like a shaker container. You cannot have my phone. Um, anyways, it's a nice shaker container and it holds, it says 28 ounces, but it's marked up to 24. So that's perfect for making formula because right now we are mixing formula and I'm pumping, but I'm also mixing the formula and then fortifying that to add calories. So she's getting um, like breast milk and formula are about 20 calories. So we are giving her 24 calories. Um, she's still breastfeeding, but she's doing, she gets a top up. Can we see her? There he is. Hi. Here she is. Hello. So she's got a little, um, an NG tube right now. So she gets half of her feed um, from me and then the other half we just give it to her or we give her like throughout the day she has a certain amount that she needs to reach as far as um, the calories from that formula breast milk uh, fortified mix. So, excuse me. So yeah, we... She gets some of her stuff through the tube and then the rest um, for me and then we're working on food and stuff like that too. So, 
I needed to pick up a few things just to hold um, everything and get organized. And I didn't, the container I was using for all of her stuff on the counter, it's just a wicker basket and it's round and it doesn't work. Um, oh yeah, pretzels, that was for Maddie. Um, and batteries, what else did I get? So containers for her medicine. This is also for mixing her medicine. Don't touch the camera. Okay, so this is also for her medicine. I needed a new containers for mixing her enzymes. The ones that we originally got um, when she was first born and first diagnosed are like missing, broken, falling apart, all those things. Uh, and then some more containers for snacks and also for like her oatmeal. Um, snacks, these are for a snack mix we're going to make. And then this will be to house her medicine and all of her like syringes and things that we need uh, for now while we're dealing with the tube. I even got to get a, I even, this is from the hospital. This has nothing to do with my grocery shop, but I got a stethoscope now. I almost feel like a real nurse. <laughs> I always wanted to be a nurse. So there we go. I'm one step at a time, right? I'm joking. I did always want to be a nurse. This was not my way I wanted to get into it. But, you know, you got to find some love in it. Uh, there was some other stuff that we got from the dollar store. The usual things for my husband. Um, bottles of water because you can get two for a dollar at the dollar store. Um, like big, huge one liter bottles. And... What else do we get at the dollar store? Some bottles of pop for him and uh, Red Bulls. Cheapest place to get it. Snack for the kids and that's pretty much it. Oh, I got a bottle brush cleaner too um, because we are back into bottles, which means we have a lot um, more to clean. Are they playing with the puppy down there? Uh, we're back to cleaning bottles and sterilizing them. So I got to get out my sterilizer. Uh, that'll be hopefully today we're... It took me a day or two just to get, you know, adjusted to being home and doing the feeding with the tubes and stuff. So, um, it's Sunday and we got home Friday. Um, yeah, so it's, uh, it's been an adjustment, but we are, we're rolling with it on the floor. Hey guys, I got a, a grocery haul for you. So, um, unfortunately just due to time and everything that's been going on in life, we kind of had to do groceries in two separate stages yesterday. So yesterday was my smaller portion. Today is the bigger portion. Um, and this is our groceries for two weeks. No, a week. Uh, I don't even know what's going on anywhere. I don't even know what day it is. It's the 13th, I think. Anyways, this will get us through until um, the weekend when I can hit up Costco and do like the rest of my bulk stock of certain things. Um, so here is my grocery haul for this week. A uh, bag of potatoes, because I think I'm down to half a bag. Some more apples, because we go through apples like crazy. Oranges were on sale. It was only 6 bucks for the case. That's an awesome deal. And chicken legs were also um, 5 bucks a pack, which is amazing. And, like, right now, my older two are gone for a couple days, because it's March break. So, we could go... Uh, excuse me. We could handle one package for dinner. But when everybody's here, we definitely need two. Um, some more bologna, hot dogs gotta have cheese even though I don't eat it we need it um eggs best deal nine dollars for 30 eggs only place you can get them though is that store there food basics um strawberries were on sale for four bucks there but they were on for a dollar 67 somewhere else so I got to price match them some kiwi avocado they're cold. they're not very ripe but that's okay we'll get them eventually sorry for the extra fruit here BJ wanted it and then bolted um he's a cereal strawberry waster Mushrooms, okay, green onion and cilantro in here. Uh, we're having meatballs tonight and rice. Um, tomorrow night we are having chicken legs. Oh, no, we're having a Dorito, chicken Dorito casserole with Meatball. most likely rice, but we'll see. Um, anyways, I perused the 50% off aisle. I thought maybe those could go with our strawberries. I realized I forgot whipped cream. I have tons of coconut cream, though, so maybe I can make something with the coconut cream. Um, sugar because we were all out and Walmart didn't have any yesterday. I found this, a sour cream alternative. We'll see how it tastes. The last sour cream alternative I had was gross. It was like, what's this one made from? Made with coconut cream. This is amazing. I just discovered coconut cream and there's so many things that it is good for and it tastes amazing. It doesn't even have a strong taste of anything, but it's super thick. It's also super high in fat, which I just discovered too. So that's awesome. Okay, um, so for our 
Dorito casserole thing. I think we need that. I forget. I have to check my thing. Um, <laughs> baking powder. Rotel. Never used it before. We'll find out. Corn. They were finally back in stock. This is the only craft dinner the kids really like. They'll eat other stuff, but this is like the one that they will eat. They absolutely love this one. And more alm or more oat milk. Sorry, wait. Did I get oat or almond? Oh yeah, more oat milk for coffee. Bagels. They were finally a decent price. Tortilla shells, bread. So I do buy this randomly. I like to make my own bread, but it's nice to have a loaf of bread in the house as well. And then white rice. We can easily go through this pretty quick. Six cups doesn't last very long in this house. And then back there, there's um, three different bags of chips and two different types of Doritos for our Dorito casserole. I'm just going to leave them in the bag that way. They're easy to put away. So that combined with Walmart is my groceries for the week. All right, guys. Sorry for the noise in the background. As always, I thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed a little view of our grocery haul, what we purchase in a week or two for some things some stuff lasts longer like obviously this will last me for like the month some stuff i end up i like to get a month out of some things but sometimes i have to stock up sooner that's just the way it is i'm gonna go make dinner some meatballs time change is kicking my butt so it's five o'clock and does not feel like it so five o'clock let's see how fast we can get dinner on the table